With the third pick in the 2016 NBA Draft, the Boston Celtics select Jalen Brown from the University of California. Don't, don't act like that in front of the camera. Don't. Jalen. Jalen. How, how tall are you? Jalen. Six foot, seven foot, twelve, boy. I'm seven foot, twelve, too. See me dunk, bro. I, I dunk on you. You dunk on me? Bro, I know you hide behind the camera a lot. You're like this big in real life. Hey. Shout out to Andy, too. Behind the cam. Because he's my guy. Sweet, man. to go shoot with Alexis and we are going to be shooting well, I guess I'm just vlogging this but we are going to be shooting with Jalen Brown uh, there's a couple highlights from Jalen Brown with the third pick in the 2016 NBA draft the Boston Celtics select Jalen Brown from the University of California Berkeley is that a three-point attempt he does shoot the three-point shot and so does Brown. Downtown, six points. Shit, I don't think I can wear those. You know? <laughs> so many shoe contracts where guys at the number Brown probably been the best player so far in this summer league. As far as the rookies go, great pass and Brown with the flush. Demetrius Jackson with a sensational pass and the rookie. That's a personal project I wanted to do. I had an opportunity to you know photograph all the Cal players. They're one of my clients. So I photograph all the new recruits that come to the school. Um, and the first time I, he was the first one I photographed and he was just a really cool person. And then I uh, you know, had the relationship with the university uh, and brought up the idea to him. I showed him my work and he loved it and said, yeah, let's do it. We got Ken right here, we're shooting in this low light. We got the S2, but what you got here? Red Dragon, Scarlet Dragon, Red Weapon, 6K. Set up with a map box and a follow focus set. No, I'm his brother. His brother. older brother. Older yeah. brother. Yeah. You from Atlanta too? I'm from Atlanta. I was born in Michigan though. So our roots is in Michigan, but we were raised in Atlanta. I uh, actually just finished rookie minicamp with the Raiders. So I'm just out here until I get signed. Oh, my man's working with the Raiders. Okay, I see you. <laughs> Already. Well, what position? What position? Defense and linebacker. Both of the brothers coming up. Hey, huh? trying to do our thing, man. Make a name for ourselves. That's what's up. And we're probably the first two to take it to a higher level, though. You know what I'm saying? He's yeah. about to get drafted. It's a really exciting time for you, then. No, right it's amazing. Everything's coming from every angle right now. Right? Right. Yeah, I'm happy for y'all, man. Hey, I appreciate it, I don't it, even know y'all. Hey, hey, I added you on Instagram. You know me oh, now. Hey, let me, let me get you back. We got, we got Jalen Brown over here getting powdered up. <laughs> Bro, stop. What's going on YouTube, y'all? <laughs> oh, what color gloss you got on? Yeah, I don't uh, recognize. That's Jamie Foxx right there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got Jamie in it. Oh. Yeah, man, you got to come with a whole hand. <laughs> I was holding the camera. Oh, My no excuses, man. Hey, no excuses. You're Where you right. from, man? I'm from Oakland. Oh, you from Oakland? Yeah. Okay. Richmond. Richmond. Oh, okay. Oh, well, look, now I got like a... The shot numbers will change. Get in the light. Get in a little silver light. <laughs> Cool. <laughs> I'm right here. First right here? On the With the Yeezys? <laughs> I'm a, I'll edit it, right? Hey, y'all, he made that. <laughs> Cut he it to where it just goes. <laughs> but you gotta act like you made it, though. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, let's do another one. <laughs> yeah, just, yeah. It might go in. There you go. Behind the scenes, y'all. <laughs> he made that shot just now. Getting his Steve no Nash pressure, on. No pressure, man. No pressure. Uh, hey. Bloopers. Bloopers. Don't, Blooper real. don't put that in. Yeah, I gotta bring like my monopod up, man. <laughs> <laughs> so, every day I wake up at 5.30, and then I'm at the gym by 6, so I'm working out from 6 to 8, mm -hmm. most likely, and then I go from like 9 to 10 in the weight room, then I come back later in the day at like 3, I go from 3 to 5, and then I'm done for the day. Oh, okay. And I do that probably Monday through Friday. So after you're done with the day, like, what do you do after? You just you just chilling? Yeah, pretty much it depends. Yeah. It kind of goes day by day. I might hang out with some friends. Yeah. Uh, I might catch up on some reading. I might 
go to the city. That's I forgot food places. Like yeah. that's my vice. Like I, yeah. I love different you love food. Different yeah, foods. different types of foods. Yeah, I'm all for that. Did you at what age did you like figure out that you separated yourself from like your peers? You know? Like on the court or off the court? Yeah. I would say officially, probably at age 13, I start realizing like what I wanted to do. A lot of guys, a lot of kids, are not really prepared for like what they're going to enter. But I knew I had a good grasp of, like what I wanted to do in life, and like how I would I get to it. So I started from that on, that point on. So I started sacrificing, probably at age 13, like video games, never been like a big video game player. And I play FIFA every now and then, yeah, but yeah. I've never been a big video game player. Uh, never went to like a lot of parties. But I can count on my hands the amount of parties I've been to in the last yeah. 10 years. Yeah. And that's ridiculous for a teenager. And locked in, I had a list of things that I wanted to do. Yeah. I had a list of things I wanted to accomplish on the basketball floor and off. Mm -hmm. And I like accomplished all of them. Yeah. But I just looked at that list every day mm -hmm. growing up. Mm -hmm. And then slowly but surely it kind of came into fruition. How, how tall are you? Right. I'm six foot, seven foot, 12, boy. I'm seven foot, 12, too. I'm six foot, seven foot, 12. <laughs> Hey, you gotta get back to work, bro. Yeah, I gotta get back. Being powdered up, I see you. ATL, hold it down. You can't, you can't be putting this up. You can't be doing that. <laughs> you gotta, we gotta get you getting powdered up. I heard, you, I heard from the neck of the woods. <laughs> um, from I'm, where? I'm, I'm from the neck of the woods. That, you know, my man. You, you inside man. I see you though. No, I'm a shooter, bro. Hey, pretty mediocre in the first. He finally knocked down a three. Chris got a little man on his game too. That likes to go and get it. I'm gonna shoot. They just ain't seen me shoot. They just, we just haven't seen. You. No, see what happened was my pinky. Yeah. Oh. The nail had a nail on it. Oh yeah. And it was like hurting. Oh yeah. You know. Yeah, I know. I feel you. And then what happened was I've been shooting with the opposite hand. Nobody knows. Yeah. I'm really left-handed. So you've only been holding that for like two minutes. Oh no, I mean I feel like mm -hmm. I'm ripped. You know, like oh, yeah. I could do this for ten more hours. Oh yeah. <laughs> wait, let me wait. Let me see your hair though. Show the people your hair. Yeah, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Like when you wear the hat, like shows no emotion. That's that's the Kev I know. <laughs> Siraj Fowler, DTC senior lighting technician, and uh, the gaffer on this gig with Jalen Brown, with American Grip Roadrunner. So this thing can hold up to 250 pounds. You know they put like really big 18k, 20k movie lights on top of this guy. A curtain or a wall to kind of confine our haze from the haze machine. So man, the lighting. 101. You already super talented makeup artist on set today. Oh, I try to be. Actually, they call it a groomer when it's an athlete. They're not a makeup artist. We use some lip balm on him and toner. Mm. And what else? And that's about it. Powder. And he's great. Oh, that's right. Like the one I covered, right? Uh, my name is Adria Cabrera. I'm a wardrobe stylist. So I think we'll probably only take about three looks, but this is usually a small amount of what three looks looks like to make sure that they fit well colors are on point with photography and lighting all those things we have to have lots and lots of extras mm -hmm. so we can pull from mm -hmm. hi i'm rose andy nice to meet you nice to meet you and you are here today because i am helping produce online produce and just assist any way i can <laughs> ah! You know what I mean? After you do the dunks, you tear it up. Hey, y'all notice that boy got sweat on his neck now. <laughs> what you call this? I call this stuff. No, you never exactly. seen it before. If we can get y'all yeah. to go like on the other side of the cow call, you call it. Like this side. You ain't side got these. You ain't Good, don't forget about that. When you, when you, when you achieve greatness. I don't know, bro. I don't know. Damn, I don't know, man. Don't don't act like that in front of the camera. Don't. Jalen. Jalen. Shout out to Andy too. Behind the cam. Cause he's my guy. Alright my man. I'm gonna follow you on IG or something. Twitter. Whatever you prefer.